And welcome back to Dominican Rendezvous. Why are some people so scared to invest in real estate in the Dominican Republic? And today, I'm gonna briefly, hopefully it's gonna be briefly, uh, talk about uh, this question and share some of my thoughts on it through the experience that I've had and the information that I've gathered over the years. Now, it's a good question and my answer is this. It is our human nature to have an inner fear of, of, of risking and losing and uh, overspending, if you will, our savings away. This fear comes from the fact that we know how much effort and time that we spent and we devoted to trying to build up uh, our wealth and our, our, our money, our savings, uh, whatever we could do to muster the opportunity to secure a future in investing in real estate. The, the real estate market in the Dominican Republic is no different as a form of investment. It, of course, like any investment, has its risks, it has its highs, it has its lows. To newcomers who may be interested in investing in the Dominican Republic, I understand it's a scary idea. But the truth is this, that the real estate market is not that complex to understand and, and eventually to, to master. You can overcome your fears and realize the opportunities that are a plethora of opportunities uh, that are available of investing in a Dominican Republic. The fact is that the most common risks facing real estate investors in the Dominican Republic are fewer than what you may expect, simply because of the stability, the overall stability of the Dominican Republic's market, real estate market itself. And so the question comes back, we come back to the question, why is it that people are afraid to invest? And I say, it's most likely, number one, because of money. They simply don't have enough of it. And this is a solid reason not to risk whatever amount of cash you have that you have saved and then to spend it all on a property that doesn't have at least 100% guarantee of success. It's scary. Uh, secondly, perhaps you're scared of eventually, if you're planning to maybe Airbnb it out, rent it out, that you're scared of being a landlord. You're apprehensive of of, of owning um, a rental home and all the baggage that comes with it. Listen, being a landlord is not easy. It does require a lot of attention to details. There's no doubt about it. It takes away your availability. It takes time. It takes resources. You have to address the needs of attendance pretty much right away when it, when it when something comes up. You need to attract tenants to come to your property and rent your property. Yes, it can be a daunting task. Thirdly, many people are afraid to invest simply because they're always waiting for uh, the perfect deal. That was me for a long time. Expectation is real. But it is the real downfall of many would-be investors in the Dominican Republic because they wait, they wait, they wait, and then they find out it's too late. And if you are waiting for the perfect deal to simply land in your lap, it will never happen for you. The perfect deal is not going to come knocking on your door. No, we, you, I need to get up, go search for the best deal. And let's... Let me just throw this out here. When of Vista Caribbean properties help you search for the best deal for you? Whether it's for land, for a villa, uh, for a second home, a retirement home, whatever the case may be, we can help you with that. Please get in touch with me. Contact information is in the description box below. Fourthly, we find that there is excessive worry about what many believe will be a properly uh, decline in value. But as the buyer, you can't control the market and the economy. And to worry about sudden drops in property value, of course, 
is, is a very real thing. I get that. I understand that. But this is what investing comes about. Because there is no sure thing, of course. But again, if you do your due diligence and you've done your research and you've had the, the best counsel alongside with you, you should be able to make a very educated and decent um, uh, decision about your investment. Fifth, another reason why people are afraid to invest is simply just inexperience. They're afraid because they have no experience, they have no, no knowledge, no expertise. They just are scared. These are the fears that hold people down, that hold them, them back. But here is the good news. And of course, with every obstacle or problem or fear in life, there is a way to overcome them or at least to be prepared to deal with them as they go. First, money and the fear of losing it. Uh, listen, I understand and we can understand that you've saved and you've worked hard all your life. You want to have a positive outlook and mindset. Success is born by, by, by effort and hard work. And again, if you do your due diligence, if you look hard enough, you will find an investment that will suit your financial needs. Keep a positive, positive mindset. I've said this in other videos about the true investor and how he looks at the real estate investment opportunities. Keeping a positive mindset. This is something that will help you along the way. Understanding that having a second source of income will change a direction of your life. And so I ask you to ask around to other investors and they will clearly tell you that even though that there was some risk, the risk of putting their money down and the fear of losing it, that overall, in general, at the end of the day, many will tell you it was worth the risk and it paid off. Secondly, as a landlord, no, it's not easy. It is not an easy task for many people who, who dabble at it for the first time. But the upside is this, along the way, you will learn some valuable skills. You will learn some basic management skills that you didn't know you had before. You will start to earn good money that you didn't have before. The investment part is easy. The management skills is really the harder work. Thirdly, you can keep waiting for the perfect deal to come to you and simply it's not going to happen this way. As I said, in the DR, there are thousands and thousands of real estate properties out there that have different values, diff different distinctives, different tastes, different uses, different significance, if you will. And the possibilities that one of these will be able to tick off every box off your checklist after only looking for a few days is very slim. And this is why we tell you, please take your time to do your research. Look at all or as many of the opportunities as you can that are out there. Take your time. Fourth, property devaluation can be overcome if you're worried about that. If you do wise and careful due diligence and study beforehand. You've heard me say this before in my other videos. Buy right. You will do well if you buy right. Fifth, an experience again. You can overcome that very simply by just getting experience. You practice, you learn, and the more you do it, just like with just about anything else, the more you do it, the easier it becomes. And look, I understand here at Buenavista Security and Properties and the Dominican Rendezvous, this channel, I understand the challenges and the fears of investing in real estate, particularly in the Dominican Republic. It is not that easy to overcome for many people, but with some experience, with some knowledge, with some help, you will know how and you will make the right decisions. With any investment, ladies and gentlemen, keep this in your head, with any investment, it has some risk. But it is important to be positive and to put your 
best effort into that investment because your best effort is what your dream deserves. And inevitably after you reap the rewards, you will remember back to this beautiful video here of Dominican Rendezvous Buena Vista Caribbean Property and the advice that I share with you. And you will become hungry for more, ready to move forward to invest in that next nice opportunity, especially right here in the Dominican Republic. Start your investment property search here with Buena Vista Caribbean Properties. We can help. Contact me. Simply drop me an email, subscribe to the channel, continue to listen to the, to the videos that we bring you, the content that I share with you. We look forward to helping you. From me to you, Dominican Rendezvous.